This is Chicago's very own WGN News at 9. Dozens of vendors at the Little Village Discount Mall were forced out last month, but now they have found a new location to set up shop. And WGN's Andrea Medina live in Gage Park with a look at the new spot. Andrea? Hi, Jackie and Ray. It will be at the old Kmart near Kedzie Avenue. The site is about 120,000 square feet, which is much bigger than their previous location. The vendors are pleased with the news that they will once again have a dedicated space to run their business. The discount mall vendors were left out, you know, after being promised six weeks of extension, which did not happen. On Friday afternoon, 5th Ward Alderman Byron Cicho Lopez was surrounded by small business owners as he announced the former Kmart at 51st and Kedzie in the Gage Park neighborhood will serve as a new home for the dozens of vendors who were forced to leave their shops at the Little Village Discount Mall. We have reached a tentative agreement to support the vendors in a new location under better conditions and to make sure that they restart their businesses. Longtime vendors expressed relief, saying they were left in the dark by the property owner, Novak Development. We work hard, we pay taxes, and we help the community where we are at. So what happened to us was unfair. Everything stopped so suddenly for us, you know, we having to pay storages, we having to do everything, and you know, the merchandise just sitting there. The alderman says the city will pay the 40 affected vendors upwards of $500,000. He goes on to say the money will be split up evenly to help pay for rent. I think it's good that the organizing of the vendors pushed the city to recognize the damage that was done. $1.4 million is not going to come back. The, the emotional damage, the stress. The former anchor store has sat empty in the Kenzie Square Shopping Center for many years and will need plenty of repairs before doors open to shoppers. Once the vendors relocate, it won't be called the Discount Mall anymore. Instead, it will be renamed Mega Mall. Cicho Lopez is disappointed to see them leave his ward, but is feeling positive about the move. I think that that can be a boost for the Gageport community, a boost for the city of Chicago, and something to learn from for every community. These are the vendors and the businesses that we need to support and not allow to shut down overnight to favor corporations like Walmart and Kmart that at the end of the day ended up leaving the city of Chicago. We have reached out to Novak for comment, but we have not heard back. The vendors will be meeting with the city next week to finalize details. And of course, Alderman hopes to have them moved in by hopefully mid, I should say mid-May. We're live in Gage Park. Andrea Medina, WGN News. Thank you.